Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today in this video we'll be unboxing Samsung Galaxy G Flip 6 and we'll try to compare this one with the last year version. So let's talk about the specs of this device uh, compared with the last year version. If you already have G Flip 5, I'll highly recommend you to hold on to that one because it's still a good device, has a lot of features and I believe you're going to get a Samsung Galaxy AI feature in that device as well as with the UI 6 as well. So if you compare head to head on the inner camera, it is a 50 megapixel S24 lineup camera. So previous generation had 12 megapixel, which is f1.8 and this is still f1.8 and ultra wide f2.2. The chipset is a great one, Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 and this one is 8 Gen 3. In terms of RAM, uh, this has a technically double, so last year had 8 gig of RAM, this year it has a 12 gig of RAM. In terms of storage, exactly the same. The battery has been bumped up from 3700 milliamp to 4000. In terms of charging, it's exactly the same, so it's 25 uh, watt wired and 15 watt wireless. Has Android yeah, 14 with UI 6.1.1 and the previous generation has Android 13 with UI 5. And the best part of it's going to have a 7 years of software support. Uh, if Samsung is supporting for 7 years of generation upgrade, that means it's going to be pretty good. In terms of dust and water resistant, it has a IP48, that means a 4 meter deep and 8 nanometer like in a dust as well. So it's kind of a dust as well as a water resistant, but last year it only had IPX8. The color is sort of different as well. So the one I got here is a blue one. Open this screen and then you can hear it. And then there's again secondary screen as well. There's a front screen. There's already built-in screen protector. So now this is time for the test. Let's uh, fold it. You can see there's no crease whatsoever. Like you can feel a little bit of bump here, but you don't, you're not going to see a bigger, like a, what the last year generation, which is the flip five had it. Let's fold it. And this is folded version. So you can see it's in folded section and then unfold it. Let's power this device on. Okay, the initial setup was done. So it took me around 20, 25 minutes. I used the cable. That means it will be faster if you use a cable. Do not try to use a wireless one. So my first impression, it, it is a very fast device. Pixel peak people. So this is a very clean display as well. If you are one of those people who's, who's thinking about the crease, you're not gonna notice any crease. Um, I've been uh, rocking the G Flip 6 in different color for over a week, just for the testing purpose. And for this video, I bought another one. I didn't notice any sort of crease difference. You're not going to even notice that one so at later in the future. There are a ton of AI feature. If you want to use like a, like a slab phone, don't try to go with S24. If you want to go S24, it's up to you. If you want to get a, like a slab, like a big phone like this, go S24 Ultra. Ultra will be the best option for you because there are a ton of S phone feature and things like that. And the camera quality is good. And then obviously the display is good. But if you are on a pinch and you want to get something that is very fast, efficient, and then, you know, obviously has a ton of air feature and a lot of software support, look no further than G Flip 6. So I will be posting more video for you guys as well, so in, in terms of software and apps and things like that. So if you have any questions, by the way, guys, you can comment down below. And this is Genius Sick signing out. Peace.